Hi guys, welcome back to TA Hunters. In this episode, I'm back out on the golf course, taking on the rabbits. I know it's been a while since I've been out here. So uh, I'm at my little dog today, and uh, we've had a little scan around the course, and we found loads of damage to the greens and the fairways. So tonight, I'm gonna to head out here, maybe get that little bunker down there, or the one over there with the uh, Air Arms S200 and uh, hopefully keep the numbers down on these uh, little bunnies. Um, I've never used a rifle on the rabbits yet. Um, I normally use this one on the squirrels and um, it is a 2.2 calibre and I'm not really used to firing a 2.2. Uh, uh, I do normally use 177 but my Air Arms Ultimate Sporter is in the uh, shop at the minute, getting a full service. So I'll bring that back out soon. But for the time being, I'm gonna bring the uh, Air Arms S200 out. So I'm quite looking forward to uh, take a few of these rabbits out. I was out uh, last week with it. Um, I've got a new rangefinder built on the side of it now, um, or attached to the side of the scope. And uh, that is in day and night as well, that works. And uh, that works a treat. So I was out just having a little play around last week and I managed to bag up um, a couple of rabbits on that one. But I'll show you that uh, early on in the video. So right, I'm gonna have a little scan around now and uh, maybe I'm gonna get in bunkers behind me tonight and um, take a few of rabbits out. Right, I've just arrived at the uh, golf course and I've got about an hour to play around with and uh, tonight I'm going to be using the uh, Air Arms S200 um, This is a 2.2 calibre and a sub 12 foot pound I don't normally use this on rabbits Well actually, I've never used this on a rabbit before so it's my first time I normally use, um, use this for squirrel shooting um, on top we've got a hawk scope with a PAR 007 that records all my night footage and we've got a uh, that's held on with the Eagle Vision mount and around the other side of the scope we've got my new toy this is a uh, night range finder uh, works night and day so I'm um, quite looking forward to take this out and uh, see if I can get a couple of bunnies but I'm not really too fussed tonight if I get anything. I'm just going out tonight, just having a little play around, play around with the ranges on this. And uh, if anything pops up, I shall take it out. So right, let's see how we're getting with this little bad boy.
Right, when coming down the golf course, I've noticed that there's a uh, a fox seems to be following me around everywhere. Um, he is quite friendly. He does get quite close to me. Um, I just think he's after a uh, free meal. So uh, whatever I shoot tonight, I'll probably leave him out a couple of rabbits. But at the minute, um, I seem to keep missing these rabbits. So you just have to wait to the end of the night and see how I get on. Right, managed to um, take out two rabbits and I missed a couple as well. Uh, the reason why, I'm not really used to firing um, a 2.2 calibre, normally 177 for me. But um, yeah, this Air Arms S, uh, S200, yeah, fires really, really nice. Um, all I've got to do is get used to the uh, distances with this. Um, but I'll get used to it. I'm going to probably um, do a bit of plinking over the next uh, week. And um, once I get used to it a bit better, I'll probably pop out next weekend and have another go with these, uh, with these rabbits. But the, um, the uh, rangefinder, absolutely brilliant bit of kit. Um, if it weren't for that, I would never shot that first rabbit. That was uh, 54 yards away, and I'd done about three and a half mil dot, four mil dot, and uh, shot it straight in the head. So, really, really happy with that rangefinder at the minute. So, right, guys, I will see you next week and see how we get on. Right, it's been a week since um, I've been back at the golf course and I've had a week of plinking with this rifle. I think I've got a little bit better of it now. So, uh, yeah, let's see how we're getting with these couple of rabbits.
Right, I thought this rabbit was a little bit further than I thought it was. It was only 29 yards away. So I uh, aimed across the crosshairs just above his head, hoping that the pellet will uh, drop in and give me a nice headshot. But the rabbit was a little bit too close and the pellet was just going over the head and uh, missing a shot every time. Right, I just spotted a bit of movement over the back and it looks like the uh, fox is back uh, trying to get a free meal again but um, he's alright, he ain't doing no harm the groundkeepers have told me on this golf course that to leave the uh, foxes alone don't try and take them out or anything like that um, because they do keep the population of the uh, rabbits down on this golf course so for now I'm going to leave these um, foxes just to uh, get on with their job
literally come up to this uh, rabbit and realised there's an hedgehog. Um, started eating his way into the rabbit. Look, you can see it's lost an ear and an eye. So if you look carefully, Mr. Hedgehog is playing dead. He thinks I can't see him. So, looks like this hedgehog is a uh, bit me to it. Oh, bless him, look. He thinks I'm going to hurt him. I ain't going to touch him. Actually, I might leave that, uh, I'll leave that rabbit for him, I think. Right guys, that's me finished for tonight. Um, managed to take out six rabbits from the golf course. I uh, lost one of them to a uh, hedgehog, which decided to uh, get there before I did and uh, have a little feast on him. And uh, the time I got to him, half his ear was eaten and the eye. So I decided to uh, let the uh, hedgehog carry on eating it through the night. But I still managed to uh, um get five rabbits on uh on film uh thanks to this rifle uh this little rifle uh, has done its job tonight very very well um i've done a week of plinking with this just to get used to it and i've sort of done a little bit better than i did last week when i first done the first outing with it but the ultimate sporter is back from the uh, shop now so it looks like I'll be taking it out next week out in the field which I'm really looking forward to so uh, but this job this uh, rifle still done its job tonight which I'm still happy about and uh, yeah it all went good so uh, thanks for watching my video um, I hope you enjoyed it uh, don't forget to like and subscribe uh, keep yourself safe. Until next time, see you later. This is T.A. Hunter.